Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Robert Drake, and I'm signing on. And we're going to be looking at the MTH evolution. So let's get started. Um, the evolution um, hybrid is a locomotive um, with uh, charging chargeable batteries in it. It uh, is more environmental friendly, and I do have one video of this. If you've watched that video, put that out of your mind because this is a more recently updated one since I've got the Digitrack Zephyr. Um, I'm going to say it again. I'm sorry for the shakiness. Um, I do not own a phone. Um, so we have a legible uh, printers label there, the GE legible printers. Then we have some uh, stickers there, and then there's a warning label. Then you have the uh, green going to blue, which ways you have a leaf here. And then that goes on to the radiator fans. With the radiator fans, you do uh, have see-throughable radiator fans. My, you do come with, it does come with ditch lights. Mine did come off. We had a wreck with an SD60. Um, head on, uh, tore off the ditch lights on that one too, so, uh, two engines do not have ditch lights, and I do not think I will review that one. The only, why, the only reason I'm reviewing this engine is because this engine is my most prided engine. So, um, we have horn, exhaust, and we've already looked at that. Uh, charging lights down there, truck detailing. Fuel tanks, another more truck detailing, and retro couplers. I do not do anything with the front, so I already pulled that one off. You have ice skated antennas. I think that's what that is, and I don't know what that one is. I think that would be a air conditioning unit, so I don't know that. Maybe an antenna. That may be an air conditioning unit. Um, so let's flip it over, and uh, you have your speakers the bottom. And that, and then we have crew figures. I don't know if you can see that, but we'll put engine back on the track and power it on. Okay. Okay, go a little bit power. You do hear the uh, startup sequence. There's a ground light here. I don't. I think MTH is the first pe person to do that in uh, HO scale. So that may be a new one for this engine. You do have two ten for the uh, road number. I've already done a uh, run by of this engine, so you can go ahead and check that out. That's a horn. Bell. Lights off is uh, zero. I just want to turn off that ground light, so. Uh, nine, I'm. Mean, what the nine does? Seven. Couple of eight. The couple of that was just something uh, that we would hear. I don't know what mine does, so we'll check that one out. Mine does nothing. Uh, Six, it turns up and down the volume. I have it set where I want it right now, so I'm not okay with that. Five also does turn off the lights. Four, um, that goes to Crew Talk, which has the beautiful So, we're going to move it out of uh, uh, one speed step, so... I'm not, I'm not going to be able to run it all the way around the layout tonight, so... And this is one of my heaviest engines, and this is not brass, I don't think. That's not one yet. One speed step. Okay, we're going to... What the hell? Okay, so 
My trap must be dirty. Still dirty. So I'll have to go to the startup sequence again. Uh, we do have a headlight and a tail light. Um, this does not have 128 speed steps on it. Um, it just has five speed steps. I don't know why. But yeah. Okay, um, I'm just gonna hold it. Yeah, see, you are That's one and a half speed steps. Actually, that's two and a half speed steps. That's two speed steps right there. Three speed steps. Um, so um, we're gonna go through the crew talk, and this is usually when you get back from the run. So. We're going to do some sequence there. You want to listen to wheels clanking. I'm looking up the uh, MRSP on this on trainworld.com. I will give you a link. Uh, it's Train World and then underneath uh, MTH. And MRSP is $269. Uh, they have actually several. They have the uh, GE Evolution, CSX, another CSX, Union Pacific. That may be my next one I go for. Union Pacific with a flag on it, Norris Folk and Southern, about three of those. Canadian Pacific, BNSF, I don't know that one name. I'm not going to try pronouncing it. Uh, maybe that's Pennsylvania there. Carnal. I uh, don't know, can't tell. Uh, doesn't tell me on there. Light Valley, M. I'm looking for a Norfolk and Southern. I'm not gonna, I don't know. I see Norfolk and Southern, but not. Kansas, oh, I'm looking for a Kansas City Southern. Never mind. So, um, yeah, that's the prices on those. And I'll give you put a link that's going to be in the uh, deal. So we're going to put this to a shutdown sequence. Come on, camera, focus. Okay, so that is the uh, demonstrator, the GE Evolution, like I said. My next one, maybe my, that engine there, I don't know, may not be, so uh, kill the power to the track. And uh, so I'm Robert Brake, and I'm signing out. Actually, before I sign out, I do want to give out a uh, big hand to uh, Kinsey Byers. She does follow me. She does not like trains, but... Um, she does follow me, and uh, she goes to school to, with me, so um, thank you, Kinsey, and uh, so I am Robert Brake, and I'm signing out.